Hi, and I'll be just talking a little bit about sinusitis. And basically, it causes its uh, symptoms and diagnosis. Also, it's a uh, treat. Basically, sinusitis is an inflammation of the sinuses caused by an allergy or a viral, bacterial, or fungal infection. Sinusitis may develop in any of the four groups of sinuses, the maxillary, the ethmoid, frontal, or sphenoid. Basically, the maxillary uh, is around your, no uh, around your nose. The ethmoid is just really between your eyes, and the frontal is just above your eyes. The causes of sinusitis, sinusitis may be acute, uh, short-lived, or chronic, long-standing. Acute sinusitis may be caused by a variety of bacteria and often develops after a viral infection of the upper airways, such as the common cold. Occasionally, chronic sinusitis of the maxillary sinuses results from tooth infection. Uh, during a cold, the swollen mucous membrane of the nasal cavity tends to block the openings of the sinuses. When this happens, air in the sinuses is absorbed into the bloodstream, and the pressure inside the sinuses decreases, resulting in negative pressure. That's painful a condition called vacuum sinusitis. Now with the vacuum remains, fluid is drawn into and fills the sinuses, creating a breeding ground for bacteria. White blood cells and more fluid enter the sinuses to fight the bacteria. This influx increases the pressure and causes more pain. Now, what's the symptoms basically for sinusitis? And what's the diagnose? diagnosis? So acute and chronic sinusitis produce similar symptoms such as uh, tenderness, swelling uh, over the affected sinuses, sinus, uh, maybe the maxillary sinus, maybe it could be the ethmoid sinus, it could be the frontal sinus. But the precise symptoms depend on which sinus is really affected. So for example, if the maxillary sinus, if it's maxillary sinusitis, which is basically basically around the nose. Uh, produces pain over the cheeks, uh, just below the eyes, uh, toothache, and headache. The frontal sinusitis produces headaches uh, over, the f over the forehead. Ethmoid sinusitis produces pain behind and between the eye and headache, often uh, described as splitting of the forehead. The pain uh, produced by sphenoid sinusitis doesn't occur in well-defined areas and may be felt in the front or back of the head. A person also may feel generally sick. Uh, the chills and fevers uh, suggest that the infection has spread beyond the sinuses. Uh, the nasal mucous membrane is red and swollen, and yellow or green pus may be discharged from the nose. In sinusitis, the sinuses appear opaque on an x-ray, so a computed uh, tomography, which is a CT scan, may be used to uh, determine the extent and severity of sinusitis. If a person has maxillary sinusitis, the teeth are x-rayed to check for tooth abscess. So really, what is the uh, treatment for sinusitis? Okay, so treatment for treatment of acute sinusitis is aimed at improving sinus drainage and curing the infection. Uh, steam inhalation uh, helps blood vessels in the mucous membrane constrict and improves sinus drainage. Drugs that can cause blood vessels to constrict, such as uh, phenylephrine, can be used as nasal sprays, but for only a limited time. So it can buy time for the person. Uh, similar drugs, such as uh, pseudo uh, pseudoephrine, uh, taken by mouth, aren't as really effective as, as phenylephrine. Uh, both acute and chronic sinusitis antibiotics, such as amoxicillin, are given, but people who have chronic sinusitis uh, take antibiotics longer. So when antibiotics really aren't effective, surgery probably will, you know, is the last alternative to cure the sinus 